I would like to ask you about something, Dr. Herman. Go ahead, Gordon. I have that toner for you. So, can you develop my film now? Why not? But come back later. I have to finish my work before I can do the pictures. What is so important about this film that you have come to me with it? You will see that for yourself, Doctor. They may be important, or they may be completely useless. He has a lot of work to do, and I have no idea what we could speak about. When it's raining, the steps are so slippery that one cannot safely descend to the water. What will it be, sir? Harry, you know everyone around here. Would you happen to know someone who can make a key? Well, I'm not sure if he's the man for the job, but Mark here has a few skills. Just ask him. All right. Thanks. What is it you want this time? It won't take long. Okay, I'm listening. I need someone to make a key for me. Harry said you can do it. A key's no problem. Give me the original and I'll bring it back with a copy in a little while. And it's for free. I'll just assume it's part of our deal today. Trouble is... I only have an imprint. Hmm. That's going to be a lot harder. I've never tried it with an imprint before. Just give it to me and pick up the result in an hour or so. I'll see what I can do. Good. Here it is. See you later. I can see you wasted little time spending my money. It's mine now, and I'll spend it however I want. I have no problem with that. Did you have enough time to do what you needed? Yes, I did. But maybe you could have rung a bit earlier. What were you doing down there anyway? That's none of your business, really. Yeah, I've got no problem with that. If you need something again, you know where to look for me. I need to speak with you, Robert. Sure. Robert, I'd like to ask you a rather peculiar question. Peculiar? I am listening. Right. Here it is. 
Is it possible for a recently deceased body to be completely bereft of blood? No blood whatsoever? Certainly did not expect such a strange question. What do you mean? Well, is there a way to drain the blood out of the body? Let me think. No, I believe it's quite impossible. A lot of blood remains in a person, even after they have bled to death, if that is what you mean. Strange, indeed. Why are you asking this? Does it have anything to do with Henry's death? Yes, it does. I spoke with Dr. Herman. He told me Henry's body was entirely devoid of blood. You probably just didn't understand him. No, I wouldn't say so. In fact, he said the same thing as you. He had never seen anything like it before. Why are you so interested in how Henry died? I'm aware it's a serious matter, but you did not even know him. It interests me when something like this happens in my home. Actually, I'm wondering why you don't seem to be interested. Well, I do not have time to worry about it right now. Henry created his own destiny, and now it is a case for the police. How come Robert isn't interested in this? I will go now. All right. Feel free to come back if you need anything, Samuel. Today's newspaper. I don't want to read it. Victoria is at the fireplace in the hall. Is there anything I can do for you? I'd like to redeem the object we talked about, Murray. Surely you remember you must present a valid bill of exchange. Don't worry. I have it. Here. Hmm. Yes, everything seems to be all right. It's 40 pounds, sir. Didn't you say 35 at first? Oh, you're right. Excuse me, I've made a mistake. Sure. I'll go get it for you right away. Bye. I picked this part up in the pawn shop. The parts have clicked into one another. For Mr. Gordon. No thanks. Maybe later. 
Have you seen Mark around? No, he hasn't shown up yet. He's probably got some work to do. Are you looking for him? Hmm? Not really. Just asking. Yeah? Samuel Gordon, uh, please let me in, Doctor. I need to speak to you. Yes, come in. I am downstairs, in the mall. Can I speak with you? Hold on a minute. Yes, I'm listening. Have you developed that film for me? Not yet, Gordon. I have work to do. Come back later. Change your mind about the dinner. My Mary makes some wonderful meals. Everyone around here will tell you that. I believe you. I'm just not hungry yet. I would like to ask a couple of questions, though. Okay, feel free. Have you seen Mark around? No, he hasn't shown up yet. He's probably got some work to do. Are you looking for him? Hmm? Not really. Just asking. Samuel Gordon, uh, please let me in, Doctor. I need to speak to you. Yes, come in. I am downstairs, in the mall. Doctor, can I have a word with you? Yes. All right. Doctor, have you got those photos ready for me? Sure, I have put them on top of the sink over there. Thanks for your time. I'll put the pictures in my diary. are much alike, only with a different symbol in the center. 